What's up guys, it's Will from TechBeat TV bringing to you a review. This is of the Exogear Edge bumper style case for both the AT&T and Verizon iPhone 4. So it does come in two colors. There is a clear version which you see here and a smoke version that I'll be demonstrating on the my iPhone. But let's go over the actual bumper case. It's very light. Kind of got this polycarbonate shell. It does cover both the volume um, buttons as well as your standby weight key. It does have covers for them so if you're looking for that type of case um, this case may be for you. It has a nice clear opening for your 30 pin connector, a microphone and uh, headphone slots so no interruption there whatsoever and a nice cutout for your vibrate uh, switch. And there's the Exogear logo. It's got a unique way of putting this on. It's not like the Apple bumper where you have to kind of force or slide it on you just kind of put it in place right so once your phone is nice and kind of has these wells that can tell that let you know like you've kind of got the phone properly seated and then you just kind of hold the top two pieces and there's this little clasp that you just press and it locks it in place right and there you have it no no real jiggling whatsoever that jiggling that you hear right there is actually the um, the uh, covers for the buttons for both the standby weight key and the volume buttons but the actual phone is not loose within the bumper um, had hoped this would provide a little bit of a tighter fit for the buttons that's why it wouldn't have that rattle uh, but it's a it's a minor gripe and, and then you do not have any type of back protection kind of wish Exogear had included even just a back screen protector would have been nice um, back and front would have been even better but it does provide protection obviously for the size of your phone so you won't be scratching your chrome or anything like that that's around there or the not chrome the aluminum uh, band and does offer a little bit of drop protection for the edges of the phone but obviously if you drop it on the back or the front no luck there with regards to protection um, not really much shock protection with this phone. There was no rubber bumpers or anything like that inside. So if you're looking for that type of case, also this might not be for you. Uh, this also does not have a lay on the table design. As you can see, it's completely flush with the phone. So setting it down on here, it, yeah, you won't really have much uh, uh, protection for the front of your screen. It really is to offer very minimal uh, protection to keep your phone nice and light. Um, it gets rid of that uh, the signal issue or the attenuation issue because it covers the band and very minimal profile and bulk added to your phone. So if you're looking at one of those minimalistic type cases, um, not looking for a slider type, not looking for anything that covers the back and you really just want to have something that covers the band around your phone, this might be the bumper style case for you. I was actually pretty impressed with it. It withstands scratches uh, really well. Um, other than that, if you guys have any questions, concerns, feel free to let me know. Um, in a private message or an email. Uh, but there you have it. If you guys uh, have any other questions, let me know and uh, catch you guys real soon with another product review. Peace. Hold it on my iPhone 4, as you can see right here. Cool design. Um, there you can see the It America kind of logo right there. It is not a flat decal, as you can 